Action. Hi, this is Lucas from Cat. Today we're dying flowers. We are. We're dying flowers today. <laughs> and who's who's over there? Lighter and brown felicity. So today we are gonna turn these really pretty white flowers. Colors. And you know how we're going to do that? Oh. Well, we are going to use something called food Whoa. color. What color did you want? Orange. Orange. And what two colors do we need to make orange? Yellow and red. Yellow and red. All right, so that's the black. Let's do, back up. That, One, is that two, so three, four. Five drops of yellow food coloring. How many drops of red do you think we should do? Uh, five. Okay. One, two, three, count. Four, five. All right. And now we are going to clip the bottom of the stem off and put the flower in the vase. And now I want to do another one. You want to do another one? Yeah. No. So now, wait, what color, what color is the flower right now? Uh, white. It's white? I thought that it was supposed to change color. How come it's still white? Because we just have to wait a long time. Oh. All right, so I'm going to leave that there. And do you think that we can make three flowers different shades of a color? Do you know what that means? What? So what does sage mean? Well, I have an idea. Do you know what color this is? What? What color do you think this is? Black. Yeah, it's black. So mommy has an idea. Because when we dye yarn, we get some really cool things from black food coloring. So mommy's going to put one, two, three drops in the first one. How many drops should I put in the second one? Six. One, two, three, four, five, six. And how many drops should I put in the last one? Twelve. Oh, that's good. Four, five, seven, eight, nine, ten. Lucas, you might almost be four years old. But did you know that 12 is 6 plus 6? And oh, mommy's hands got all food coloring y. Alright, so now I'm going to take three different flowers. Cut off the stems. We're going to cut off the stems. Mama! Now do the. And we're going to put these three flowers in here. So they each have a different amount of food coloring. And so we'll see if the flowers look Mama. any different. Mommy, now I want mine to be, next I want mine to be purple. You want to do a purple one? Okay, just a minute. Let me make purple again. Oh, white, red and blue. Oh, we need red and, we need red and blue to make purple? Yeah. Here, why don't I move our black flowers over here, our orange, wait, but what color are those flowers? Still white. Still white, okay. So we're going to do this by mixing pink and blue. Ready? Two, three, four, five. How about six drops of pink? And how many drops of blue? Uh, twenty. Uh, twenty, I think that's too many. Two, three, four, four five, five, six. Isn't that pretty? Yeah, now let's put the flower. Okay. I clipped off the end and I put in a flower. And so now, do you know what we need to do? What? We need to wait. Let me bring them. Now I want to make another flower. You want to make another flower? So see, we've got three different blacks because maybe we'll see the colors on the flower split into many colors. Oh. We've got an orange one. And a purple. For me. Yeah. These are mine too. Those are your two? What do you think? Mm -hmm. 
a wobbly wobbly wing. Mm -hmm. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Okay. And you want to do pink? Yeah. How many? Uh, twelve. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Okay. Now let's put it. Now let's. And now we're going to leave these ones as well and wait and see what happens. We tried to split some stems in half, so that way maybe we could get them in two colors, but I always ended up either breaking off the other half of the stem, or when I tried to balance it between the two cups, that was hard. So maybe that's for advanced florists, and we'll stick doing single colors, right? Can I do one last one? So what do you think is going to happen to these flowers? They're going to die into yarn. <laughs> They're going to die into yarn? No. Do you to ch how long do you think it'll take for them to change and to become different colors? Uh, I think 20 minutes. Set a timer for 20 minutes. Set a timer for 20 minutes? Okay. So, Lucas, what? it's been 20 minutes. What color are almost all the flowers? They're all white. They're all white? Uh-huh. Okay, so maybe we should check again in the morning, okay? Uh, have you, are you good at talking to books? I'm not good at talking to books. <laughs> it's been almost two hours. Do you see anything with your flowers? Different? Yeah, let's see. Here's the white one. And do you notice anything? No, I don't. Like one, two, three, four. What do you see? Carrot gentle. Look at look at this one. What do you see? It's blue. It's trying to be blue. You see some blue? Yeah. Oh, but look at this. My purple is looking very blue right now. Is that one? Yeah. And your orange is looking really yellow. No. <laughs> cool. We'll check it again before bed, okay? These we have lines. They have lines on them? Yeah. Wow. And what color? Maybe this one. But this one has no lines. Just one, two, three, four, five. That's five of them. Yeah, and look, th these oh. ones have a little bit of color. Whoa, look at all this color. That's one of the black ones. Lucas, good morning. Good morning. What do you see? Let's prepare. Let's prepare. Well, tell me, can you tell me your observations? This, what color is okay, you tell me. This flower is well all plain. It's all plain? Why do you think it's plain? Because it's in plain water. Oh, can you say that again? Because it's in plain water. Oh. And now look at... Uh, it's cutted. Yes. Now, careful. Now, Lucas. See these flowers up here? Yeah. These are the ones we did with black food coloring. And do you remember that we did three drops, six drops, and twelve drops of food coloring? Lucas, is there a difference between this flower and this flower? Well, that one has Huh? That one has green and that one has, well, beige. Oh, which one is the darkest? This one is the darkest. Yeah, and you know what? what? We add the most food coloring to that one. Is that cool? Yeah. Did, There's did. the food coloring. All right, now let's look at the other ones. Oh, this stem is well black. It's <laughs> black? Well, what color is the flower? Bluish. Yeah. And this, this, what color this, is this one? This stem is brown. Red is. And the, it's yellow is on top. Yeah. <laughs> and then what about these last ones? <laughs> Let's move them a little. Okay, we can move them a little closer. Careful. 
I don't want to spill. This stuff is well empty red. Mm -hmm. This stuff is the same as the empty green. This stuff is empty black. That stuff is empty orange. Well, that's not the stems. That's the water, honey. So, what color is this flower? A yellow. Please put it down. <laughs> and what color is this last one? Well, reddish. Yeah, so do you think that we should leave them in the colors for longer and see if they get even more color? Yeah, let's keep on watching and watching it up. But that white one is, well, plain water of this. <laughs> and the stem is green. Lucas, it's been three days since we've been working on these flowers. And can you see a difference between these four flowers? So this one is plain and these ones are not. Okay. Well, let's look closely at these three that are not plain. They have color. They have color. Well, which one has the most color? Look at the flowers. Which one do you see is the darkest? This one has the most color. Yeah, and you know what? what? We put 12 drops of food coloring into its water. And do you remember how many we put in this one? Six, and this one three. Yeah! Isn't that cool? And this one, none. Yeah, so it looks like the more food coloring you put in the water, the darker the color you get. What do you think? Good. Yeah? So, the, so their stems changed color. The stems? What part's the stem? Like that one is red, that one's purple, that one's red. Yeah, so we didn't quite get a purple, but we got a lot of other really fun colors. We got orange and a yellow green. Look, the, that green. The purple one that we tried turned pretty blue, but that's okay. And we got the lovely blacks that we've shown. Lucas, what did you think of the science experiment? The various fix. Okay, I don't know what that means. But did you have fun? Yes. And what did we learn? We learned more of a die pop weekly. <laughs> no, we learned that what happens if you put food coloring in water and then put flowers in it? They change color. Do you want to do this again sometime? Yay! And I have an <laughs> I promise I did not prompt him to say that. I think someone has just been watching me edit a lot of videos lately. Thank you for watching this fun dyeing project. I'm Rebecca from Chemnitz, and this is... Lucas! See you later!